Ilholm Shardiev loved his family deeply. He had a lot of uh, big plans for his uh, for his family. I would say over a year, he bought a house here in Charlotte and was planning like where his kids would go to school. Shardiev was identified Friday as the driver of an Amazon truck fatally shot on Interstate 5 while driving. His 18-wheeler veered off the busy interstate and crashed into a business before Shardiev was rushed to the hospital. To be honest, it's, uh, it was devastating news for us to hear, especially the way it happened. And uh, while well, all of us still experiencing that state of shock. He lived in Charlotte, North Carolina with his wife and two young children. Family friend Aziz Azami spoke with us from there by Zoom. He was a man of principles, always tried to reach out the helping hand to others. And he was a volunteer in one of the organization here in Charlotte who helped refugees. Investigators say they've received tips, but don't have the information or video they need just yet. They're encouraging anyone who was driving northbound on Interstate 5 between State Route 120 and Louise between 12.30 and 1 Thursday to call their tip line. Zami says despite hearing what has happened, it still doesn't feel real. Right away, like, to be honest, I couldn't move. I was, I was numb inside. And also, the way it happened, it just really makes me angry, to be honest. Azami says his friend worked to provide for his young family, joining Amazon just a few years ago. He says Shardiev's wife is heartbroken. We'll be here, his, his close friends, of course. I mean, we'll take care of his family until the rest of, of our lives. Leon Denyer, KCRA 3 News. A GoFundMe is now raising money for the victim's family. CHP says that anyone with information is asked to call the tip line at the number you see on your screen, 916-731-6580.